Good morning. It is 8.17. We mean this little one. Woke up at about 7.10. She is really great. She likes to play in her crib a little bit. So that was awesome. I just got her some food. Let's go check out what she's eating. I didn't do anything fancy. Um, Nick left this morning at like 6 a.m. for work. He is not going to be back until Tuesday. So... <clears throat> We will be solo. So this weekend is just all about hanging out and just yeah. Um, I got my hair done yesterday too, so it's kind of like that fresh hand sewn feel. So it's a little tight. Um, I cut up some apples, some plantains. I absolutely love dried plantains, so I was interested to try them. Uh, I almost said wet, not dried out. Uh, all of our strawberries about to go bad, so trying to do that. Did also want to show you real quick sidetrack squirrel uh, if you've been watching my Instagram stories we've had this since Harlow's um, baby shower and this whole thing came off and it didn't exist and then it grew again and our flowers just bloomed I've never been able to keep an orchid alive and I have done it I have done it what are we eating over here you almost ate all she got a couple little rice crispy treats I did those instead of Cheerios today we got some egg some rice, some plantain that you nod on. She's been really loving the green apples. We've got some bed head going on on either side today. Are you cute? Are you so cute? Do you have some dried boogers on your nose? Good job. Those are hard to pick up. You're so little. Good job. I'm feeling energetic. Yesterday I was really tired. I was like falling asleep when they were doing my hair. Um, so what are the plans for today? What are we doing today? I don't have a list going yet. I'd like to make one, but honestly, I kind of just want to enjoy my weekend with Harlow and just do whatever comes to us. While she's napping, I haven't decided yet whether I want to try and work or just watch TV and relax. <laughs> so I might do a little bit of both. Ow. 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 I will have my food when she takes it. <laughs> She takes a nap around like 9.30 to 10.30. I kind of let her choose. Hey. What? You got rice in your hair and on your head. <laughs> the stove stuff has been interesting. If you guys have any tips, thankfully the stove doesn't open easily, but when she's stronger and more coordinated, I'm a little nervous about this. Definitely where it's at. This is Marvin Gay, kid. I am making a corn garlic scramble. Have you guys ever put corn in eggs before? It's really actually quite good. Um, and then I made these yesterday for Nick and I. I'm just heating them back up. Some potatoes. And baby's down. We're going to enjoy our breakfast. And then I think I need to clean this stove. You know what I've really been craving that I might need to get this weekend or maybe do it Monday. I'm not sure. Monday is usually kind of one of my little cheat days. But I've been really craving carne asada fries, but I don't get the carne asada. Instead, I just get extra cheese and extra guac. So it's basically french fries smothered in avocado, guacamole, um, sometimes sour cream, and uh, cheese. And it is just like, you get a fork and you go up that bitch. Oh, it is so good. So I've been craving that. I don't know where around here has good carne asada fries. So I'm going to figure that one out. That's a lot of food. <laughs> Maybe my eyes are bigger than my stomach. We'll see. Well, I definitely am actually still hungry. So I think I'm gonna eat some fruit. <laughs> We're having a very hard time falling asleep for nap time. I think there's a monster in the other room. <laughs> Sounds like a little dragon. She usually doesn't take this long to fall asleep. So I'm gonna check and make sure she didn't sew her diaper but um, she has a tendency to love to do that right when she goes down for nap time and I have to get her out. So let's see, if not, I'm gonna leave her and go take a shower. 
we've started moving my animals into this room right here. So I have some chores to do in there. So let's get to it. his hide he's never hid there before and i was like there is no way that he got out of this cage and out of this room when the doors were closed my day just went from good to bad back to good <laughs> i just put this christmas moo moo on that nick absolutely hates <laughs> and i am going to do the dishes this has got a lot of control and then after that i'm going to clean the living room up so let's do it Nick has been asking me to organize some of my things in the garage. So I'm going to see how long this little one <laughs> will hang out in one of her bouncers in the garage while I organize some stuff. Um, also, I wanted to show you this. this is super cute. I got a new phone case on Amazon. Isn't that so cute? Focus. It's a cute little little phone case. I like that. It comes with like a little pop socket for the back too. Her bedtime, it's 640. Her bedtime is like seven. So we'll see. She's been fighting all of her naps today. Um, but it looks like she's done eating everything that I put out for her. So let's try our luck. This is a wonderful book. I like my tabs. <laughs> when he's acting like a jerk. Female button number one. He may try to make you jealous of another girl. Trust, respect. This is such a good book. There's why men, I think there's like why men love bitches and then there's, this is the like next step. Highly recommend. Good morning. Are you turning the TV on for us? You got pretty far. Is that how you help determine what we're gonna watch? You shove it in your mouth? <laughs> Can you not put that in your mouth? It's probably not the cleanest. I got this little outfit, matching outfit, super cute because these can go under my belly. My belly is so itchy this morning. Oh my goodness. Super itchy. Um, I'm gonna open some of these PR packages that I picked up the other day. And today, this morning at 11, we're gonna go meet my friend Claudine. She's another fire wife for brunch. I probably won't film at that because I just want to enjoy the moment. But I definitely have to show you 
I may not even bring my vlog camera. We'll see, but it's really cute inside. It's this new place called um, Toasted Gastro Brunch in Oceanside, it's super cute. So we're gonna do that, and then I don't really have any plans for the rest of the day. I do have a little bit of a to-do list. Where is that? So we've got PJ Photo with Harlow, vlog, get ready with me for the weekend vlog, for a weekend vlog, um, for, that's for this vlog, so I would remember. <laughs> Film with Harlow for a pregnancy announcement. I still, that's literally supposed to go up tomorrow. I still haven't done that. By the time you're seeing this, that will have already been up. So if you wanna check it out, I'll link it. Um, our, I need to update the calendar for my house in Nashville on Airbnb. Maybe I'll film my makeup routine and hair today. We'll see what happens, brunch and then vacuum. This is some personal to-dos right here. And I think we need to take Harlow on a walk today. Walk with Harlow. I know you're not chewing on the edge of that carpet. No, you're not. My boobs are so giant and so swollen and so sore. Like, I don't remember this happening except in the very beginning of my pregnancy with Harlow. They're like so giant right now. When I was FaceTiming with Nick last night, I like pulled up my shirt and I was like, dude, look at these things. He's like, Hey, can we have some day sex soon? I was like, I feel like a whale, but if you're into it, yes, we can do that. Two Face. Two Face on the When I use my witchcraft. When I use my witchcraft. Want to see Daddy? Call Daddy. Daddy. Wanted to call you. She asked me if we could call. It's about as awake as I am. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like you had a pretty gnarly night. Dog shit. You relaxing body lotion. Harlow is refusing to nap right now. She literally sounds like a dying cat. So I'm gonna have to turn on some Bella Fiore get into some murder mystery and do my makeup. And I don't think because of that screaming and crying, I'm gonna really be able to focus to do that one to-do list that I wanted to do where I could just like do my makeup and hair. Like I need no time limits for that kind of stuff when I film, like I just can't be rushed. So, or like stressed out. And it stresses me out to hear my baby crying. I'm sure you can relate if you are a mother or a father. <laughs> So um, yeah, we're just gonna, I'm just gonna put some makeup on. I'm gonna, just gonna keep it pretty simple, I think. I, I don't know, I don't wanna spend too much time. Close your eyes to hide your lies, roll the dice. You got me tiptoeing around you like you made a glass. Got an invincible fence, letting everyone know not to trespass. Just put this really cute dress on. Oh my gosh, so I put on the new Too Faced um, lip injection, uh, lip liner and my lips are like burning. Like I just rubbed a jalapeno around the outside of them. I don't know if it's actually making them bigger, but I just put on this super cute dress and I love this. The back is really cute too. However, it's 61 degrees right now in Oceanside and I feel like it's just going to be really nipply and just too cold to wear this, but like how cute is this little dress? Just check out the fact that you can't see like any of my extensions. Like you can usually see all of my extensions from there. So I'm pretty excited about it. Did my child just leave the room? <gasps> Harlita Panchita, <gasps> you get your little booty back in here. Here's what we ended up with. This is a top from Old Navy. I love these tank tops. I've been using them for the gym. Um, I really, really like them. That thing is so loud. Um, and then these, I don't know what, what brand these are, but these are, um, I think, I want to say I got them at Target, but if I can find them, I'll link them below. They're maternity jeans. I have pretty much never worn maternity jeans. Hey, can you move out of the way? Thank you. And then I cut them on the bottom so they looked a little less mom and a little more cool. Um, little slides. And then I'm going to pair this with a leather jacket. And I got, I did um, some little hoops here. I don't know what, this is like automatically playing this like winter aesthetic on the screen. That's the last thing I want with the weather that's been going on here, I need to change that. Um, and then a couple little necklaces. I think this one's from Marin Costello. I'll link everything that I can in every video as usual down below. But um, 
I get annoyed when maternity jeans sh show like <laughs> this. So I kind of need a longer shirt, but these shirts have been so comfortable. I've been wearing them at the gym and they've just been, um, it was on sale for $10 at Old Navy when I was there. So I actually bought three, a black one, a white one, and then like a tie dye one. And I want to go buy more of them. They're like just the perfect tank for the gym. Anytime I like the racer back. I like how the neck and everything and 10 bucks is like a good deal. Heading to brunch now. I am a half an hour late. That was a mess. <laughs> I couldn't find my keys. And then I got everything into the truck and realized that Nick had taken the car seat completely out and I notoriously suck at installing them. So that took me a minute. But we are finally almost there and it is a beautiful day. So I'm gonna try and shake this annoying um, shit morning, I guess. So I got a Bloody Mary and I asked for the alcohol on the side so that I could give it to Claudine. <laughs> Look how much fucking alcohol they gave me to <laughs> Also, if I wanted to put a tiny bit here, uh, where would I put it? <laughs> um, that's, a, that's a lot of that's, that's so much food. Okay, this is... I, I pretty much always say when they order a dirty martini, order the alcohol on the side because they always give you more. And I mean, this is like a testament to it. Look at that. Yeah. They're like, oh, it's gonna look like nothing if I just, like that is like a normal serving like down here. Is that crazy? Is that crazy? She's got her little nugget sleeping in here. You should see how much hair this child has. More hair than us put together. I just left the pet store. I've got one earring hanging on. That was challenging. She was literally grabbing at every single thing I was holding, pulling my earrings, pulling my necklaces, doing this. Nick is like, why don't you ever go anywhere with Harlow when I'm at work? And I'm like, because it is so challenging and not worth it. <laughs> I mean, some things you just like have to do, but like today, was so just challenging so far. And it is 3.01 and she still has not napped. We were gonna stop by and see her dad at the station. I brought some like drinks for them, but you know what, we're not gonna make it. She's gonna, she needs to go take a nap cause I have to get her up by five. So I'm gonna head home. Hopefully she falls asleep on the way. And overall it was, a, overall it was a success, but very difficult. <laughs> It's, it's your bedtime. Actually, it's 30 minutes out past your bedtime. You're trying to put it in my mouth. <laughs> You just said goodnight to daddy on the phone. <laughs> oh, so cute. They're so cute when you love your teddy bear like that. Ow. I wish you would hug me like that. Can I get some of that? I am super exhausted. My makeup is super expired. And um, Harlow went down so fast and so easy tonight. It was wonderful. It was a blessing. <laughs> I have had a very trying weekend. I don't like put frustration and negativity onto the vlog very much or talk about it because it's like, you didn't come here to like, like I don't watch videos to hear that from other people. So I kind of just assume like y'all are the same. So I just try and keep it like pretty handy dandy, positive, um, easy peasy lemon squeezy on here. So anyways, I had, I had a, this weekend, man, like the kittens, like every animal, that's not in a cage, and that is in a cage, if you guys remember my snake yesterday, uh, has been just like trying my patience. <laughs> and I'm gonna go take a shower, wash my face, and just climb into bed and watch some trash TV for a little bit and then pass out. And tomorrow I'm gonna get up and go straight to the gym and just spend some time with myself and have some me time. And then I have to go meet with my CPA. Wah, wah, wah. But anyways, thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoy this type of vlog, then let me know in the comments. Um, commenting helps me out. It helps my channel out. And so does uh, turning on notifications and giving this video a thumbs up. So 
please do those things if you want to help me out and also um, subscribe to my channel. And we will see you guys in the next video. Bye, y'all.